All right, everyone, in this video, we will continue working on latest courses. Okay, let's go to our project. All right, let's create a section. So ID, I put latest courses. Okay, let's create container. And then we need uh, the container to be at the center. So we put MX auto and PX equal to, okay. And in the latest course, we have our latest course heading over here. So let's put it over here. Head to latest course. And then I put class, so I want the text to be large, so I put text XL. Uh, and then I need font bold, and I need space at the bottom, so I put margin bottom 10. Okay, okay, I need space uh, in this section as well, so I put class uh, padding y-axis 16 so this look good okay next we are going to create a box that contain card okay we put div and we have a uh, three card over here in one row so we put div class with one third because we need three box in one row or three card in one row the card contains image and text over here you see so we just put uh, image over here and we put source and then we put div this is uh, the div that contain text so we put h4 and then I just copy the text over here learn basic JavaScript okay and then copy the description over here so I can put p tags for description and then we need a button take a course so we can put a tag so I put href nothing okay Okay, I'm going to export this image to our project. Let's export it out. So JavaScript course image. Okay, save. So let's include that image over here. Image JavaScript course save. All right, let's take a look at the preview. Oh, we need container over here. So the container just cover this one. Just make the container cover everything. Sorry, just it over here. Okay. Okay, the image width needs to be full width. So I put class with full save. Okay, it look good. All right, we need a, a box shadow for this card. So we put box shadow over here. Shadow, I put LG. Okay, this look good. We need a padding over here. So we put padding here, so class. Mm, px is 4 padding x axis padding y axis is 6 okay this look good so I need a border radiance for this card so I put uh, rounded LG so I need a border radius over here so I put I can put over 4 hidden 
all right this look good all right what else we need to change this text to be bold here so we put class font bold okay and we need space so we put p uh mb2 okay and we look at it okay it's look good and for this one we put class mb2 as well we need margin button to be two all right this look good so we need to change this to be a button so we put class bg red 600 and then in line block and we need px padding x axis is equal four padding y axis is two and change the text to be small and text needs to be white okay okay this look totally good all right the next step we just copy this card all right this is the card and this div is pairing up this card okay so we can copy this one one two okay we have three cards right now so we need this card to sit side by side so we just come to the parent class and put class flex okay it's going to sit side by side i need some space between each card so i can put uh gap gap six okay all right this look good and this look similar to this one okay just e export this image out uh, php course image export this image out mm, blockchain course image all right let's change this image to be uh, php and this image is blockchain course all right let's change the title or the, the course name learn basics php to develop website and this one chain is to be learn blockchain technology for the future save and let's take a look at our website all right it's look pretty similar to figma layout okay in the next video we are going to create student feedback section